Happy New Year's everybody, well, this is a New Year's Eve stream. Uh, a bit of a random one, because I, this is, I was going to follow up on some of the streams we've started, but we've got another technology upgrade to our stream, so we now have the Dreamcast is running at, uh, through the VGA box basically, and it's a Japanese setup, so it's running like maximum resolution and at 60 frames. So I thought, oh, let's just bring out one of the games I haven't played on it, and uh, do a bit of stream of that. So this is Tokyo Highway Battle, or I think Tokyo Extreme Racer as it's known in like, the West, in two different names, and in Japan it's just called this, the uh, Shotoku Battle. It's basically the it's initial D without the name, the brand, or maybe this is before that came out, I don't know. You race around the highways in Tokyo, it's a race that works, it's not a surprise based on the name. Uh, but it has an entire quest mode where you can like buy cars and that, so let's go. Let's get into it, right, so you, obviously this, well, the fact that the AE86 is the first car that comes up tells you this is an initial D knockoff, whether or not it's from the manga or if the game exists, I don't know, but... Alright, so, what's that, the MR2? Oh, it's got prices. Oh, so, wow, can you really only get one of those? Oh, I see a Subaru. Oh, that's why I really want the FD. Let's see. A Sylvia or like a, a Toyota would be nice. Obviously, uh, no one's driving an NSX and street races is too expensive. DC2, the most hated car. That's the car like I will always hate now because in initial D at its height, like in version 2 and 3, that car was just unbalanced and everyone's driving it. So, you know, how it's like the meta just becomes drive this car. So, I'll never do that. I hate that car. Uh, Civic, nice. I don't even know. This is like a Western car, right? Oh, no, Toyota Crown, probably. Why does it even say the name? Oh, they haven't got the licenses, so it doesn't like it. So, that's the Mercedes, so that is the European. Fair Lady Z. Oh, oh, an R32. Can we have an I32? Oh, that's expensive. Oh, that would be nice to have an R32. Cool. Uh, what's that? Like another RX7? I'm not sure what that is. Oh, oh uh, SX180, whatever it's called. Uh, oh, here we go. Oh, S14. I'll probably get that with my money. Sweet. Oh, it's, oh an S13. I don't like that even more. Not in pink, obviously. But yes. Oh, I haven't got my. Because we're, we're not. We're in. Uh, Jewelry rig that's set up here for New Year's Eve. I haven't got my iPad, so looking at chat's gonna be a little bit more difficult. Oh wow, they've got the Super Ray. Okay, back to there. So yeah, it's gonna be S13. Right, so can I get it two tone? Maybe do that because I want the black, like undertone bit of it. Cool. Oh nice. I'm just gonna put in Sylvia, I guess. Can we do to the ED's end? Right, so where's L and R is? Let's do that. What's X? What's Y? B. Oh, that's A. B is going back, but it doesn't delete. Oh no, I'm good at games. Again. It's still too good. Right, let's try again. So you just put the, write the name over it, I guess. I'm not even going to do lowercase. It makes more sense to do it this way. You can actually name your car, so we could just call it John or whatever. Uh, space, I guess. There we go. Oh, no way, you actually get to customize your number plate. Well, there's not too many games that do this. So MSR does it famously, which is nice. Uh, let's see if I can recognize any of these basically. That's Mountain something. So Yama something, I guess. I only know a few kanji. Um, so I'm going to pick ones I know. Uh, Iwaki, is it? Wow, that's what it says, but I don't understand why. Okay, I'm probably going to go for that. That is something forest. There's the one with the river, so it can be like Shinagawa. Oh, there's all sorts of things. Oh my god. Oh, this one is something river. Maybe that's Shinagawa, maybe? I think it might be. This is... That is it! Okay, it's something, Kawa. Okay... Sorry, this is probably a waste of time for people reason. This is Naniwa. It's probably Tokyo. Are you supposed to be just regions? You think? Bloody hell, is there enough of these? This must be every different, like, district in Tokyo. I would assume. It might even be across the country, but... Oh, cool. Uh... I kind of like that way that one looks, honestly. Uh, I don't know what we're going to put for numbers. Let's say... Hey? Oh, it's only got diff there must be certain regions where you can have certain numbers. I don't know. What? Oh my god, what is happening? That'll do. And you can change this for whatever reason. That says no, so I'll just have that because it's fun to have no. Bloody hell. It's got one of the typical code we're going to be putting in. Boom. No way. After that, you put no and you have to restart. <laughs> Okay, uh, speed, something, 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 four people, something, 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 something. Okay, there you go, that, that sums it up. I don't think anybody can understand the story now. Maybe there's four classes, or four races, could be four races, four tracks, maybe. 300 kilometers, I think. Of, um, cowboy Bebop! Can you be a street cowboy? It's probably what it's saying. 
Oh, the four divas. Okay. So that's like the four kings we have to try and defeat in races, I guess. We have to work up to it. That's cool. I hope they get like manga esque pictures for their faces, like as if it really is like initially. Can you become the cowboy of space and, and the road? Oh, cool. 1999. Dreamcast launches. Tokyo Highway Battle. The end of a century, cowboys! What the hell? Is such a great, like, English title. That should have been the name of the game. 1999, the end of a century, cowboys. Nothing, like, to denote it as racing or anything. Okay, so we've got. Uh. Oh, great. Garage, okay. Uh. Tuning. We have. The shop. What's this one? That's battle. System. Uh. Level? Oh, rival. And that's the shop. We've got 5,000 money to sell. Oh, is it just cards? Where do you get parts? Is that tune? Aha. Uh -huh. You get any cool bits for it? Oh, right. So that's engine. Other thing. Other thing. Chassis. Why oh, you can do a lot of something. Uh, muffler. Uh, wheel. Arrow. Oh, arrow I want to do. And uh, color. Nice. Okay. Oh, great. Can we like, mess about with the... Uh, Tuning. Excellent. This is cool. It really is initial thing. Huh? I actually don't think they look better than the standard one, sadly. That's not too bad. Oh, type one is a, it's fine. Do you want to quit this yet? Yeah. This is cool. It must have gone to a lot of lengths to like. Uh, actually, like it the way it is. Lights? Can you get? How does that change? Oh wow! What? They get the library. I don't think that's going to change the uh, performance somehow. Oh, Bonnie, here we go. That's quite cool. What the hell is that? Kind of nice. Mirrors are not too bad. Side skirts. Let's, let's actually do some racing so the stream isn't a complete bore. Uh, can you do colours other than the ones that you start with? Oh, you can! What the hell? That is really nice. I take it that. Does it keep the two tone? Because that's what I want to do. Oh, it's part two. You can actually change both. I want white, which is what I wanted originally, but with the two tone, which it didn't have. Now you can create it. That's so cool. You can create any colour. It's one of those things that in a modern game they're probably not going to start doing because selling you cosmetics is a big thing. I mean, I know Forza is very good for that, but like if they let you tune it to any possible colour that exists, and they, then there's nothing they can tell you as far as like coloured skins. Nice. It's probably too white for anything, but like, again, I don't want to spend years in this. So. Excellent. Right, let's go out there and race then. So that was battle. So you can go around the two different ways. I think there are there might be more than one track. I've got uh, how about two here as well. And there's loads more in that. I don't know what that means. I think that just means manual or auto. I think I'm going to manual, right? Oh, he's like driving into a blue max atomic waste there. One of the divas has just detonated a nuclear weapon. It's the only way to stop me. Only way you could stop me. The handling is tough. I tried a bit just to make sure the VJ output was all coming out nicely. Um, it's tough. Obviously to get a stream, but I mean I have a stream, but it's not here. Right, so I think you just drive around and you have to like antagonize people with your lights to race them. Because I'm that the part I haven't done in the practice. Oh, Where am I on the map? Yellow. Am I coming up to blue or going away from it? I can't tell. Oh, is this a guy here? Do you get to see their power level before you like antagonize them? Oh look at the picture! No, come back. Let's just get him. He's green. Means he has to die. Is that uh, Levin? What's he called? Rolling guy. He looks great. This is like somebody out of Mad Gear in Final Fight. Yeah. Oh, cool. Time special D style Euro B. Uh oh. Oh my god. The hitboxes on those things are terrible as well. You get wrecked even if you're like anywhere near it. Oh my god. Yeah, cool. I like the environment. Nice. I don't know if those are like. Uh oh. Cut-offs in the road and things like that. So basically, the premise is, it's not like you get to a certain point and win like a lap or whatever. You, like, although that, I guess, that could happen. You, the longer they're ahead of you, or, or vice versa. Oh no, you lose it. Oh my god. Ah, oh, come on. That's brutal. I would rather just slow me down than just say you. It's the end. Um, nice. Got some cool replays. Yeah, you basically the longer you are ahead of them, the further are ahead, the more health they lose, and the same to you. 
I'll see if they run out of health or something. So healthy, if your two cars are really close in um, ability, the races can be really long, I see. Oops. Oh. Didn't mean to go back to free road. The spoiler looks really puny there. I don't think it is, but it looks terrible on this view. And you only have... Oh, you get a rear view. Thank you. Oh, so I wondered about that, because one of the key things, obviously, is once you get ahead, there's not, like, a whole lot of corners and that, so you, you really need to stay ahead of them and just block them. And when you're in this view, you just can't do it. Oh, taxi sense. I love the lights thing, the way they've got the streams on them. Um, yeah, like, you, you can't, you have no chance to do any blocking in this view. There's no way, you can't, there's no look back button, there's nothing like that. But obviously, you've got your rear view in there, nice. This is pretty sweet, like 60 frames a second, and it can do two views like that. Oh, oh yeah, that's you being terrible. Oh, lucky I'm not actually in a race. I guess you have infinite time. It's kind of an interesting premise where you're like, you just drive it. This always reminds me as well of, um, you know, in Gran Turismo, the later ones, they always have like one Tokyo Highway and another one. It feels like this. There's no traffic there, we love traffic in our games, so I need speed is so good. Yeah, that seems like it's pretty cool. You, to, you would get tired of the fact that the tracks, even if they have different layouts, it looks the same thing. In the Dark City. Here we go, right, how good is this guy? Let's just get Curving Edge! Oh, it's me! Oh no, I. I Oh, come on, game, don't be terrible at the beginning. Give me a chance, my brother. Okay, it waits until that happens before it starts, that's good. What's 25? Is that his rank? Cool, right. Look at the start in front of this. I didn't catch his car, it might be a DC2, in which case I must win. I wonder if the rival screen is why you can re challenge them or something. Go after a certain one, so I guess we have to go after the divas eventually. And I don't know if we're just going around, it's going to get us the result we want without actually having a target. Uh oh, man, it could come up quickly. Does this help? Really? You need to actually look at the map, I guess, to see when it's going to get bad. Good, I'm getting them. Obviously, it starts out easy. Uh -oh. oh, yeah. Got him. So I had all my health left. Oh, the shorter the battle, obviously. The more. Oh no, it seems like it's the longer the battle, the more points. That's weird. You gotta try and like eke it out. I guess it means I uh, probably because if you challenge loads of weaker people, you're gonna you get money. It's just gonna be a stupid like, like, way to get money. You instantly beat them. Like, they want to give you less money for that, which is good. Okay, so what? Carry on, and then eventually you're about to shop and use your money, I suppose. It's a real shame that the light thing isn't the horn, of course, even if it could be just both at the same time. Up, up, up. I guess in the second one maybe they have it. Because the D-pad is left to just do nothing in this game, so they could have had like four more buttons. Like wipers maybe if it's raining. Which I don't think is in this. It should be. And um, the horn obviously would be a major one as well. And also I don't think there's a handbrake either, but the drifting in this is actually really cool. I better show that. I did, I did a bit too much braking on one of the corners and you get cool. Points for drifting, you absolutely should, obviously. In real life, at least give you more points. So. Oh, Civic. This is like one of the bad guys in initial D, isn't it? In Red Civic. Flash, flash, flash. Yeah, some of the shots are really good. That's class. Let me see the front of the car. The replays look good. Oh, what's red? Does that mean he's a really difficult opponent? Didn't say 25. Can I get past Like a. Can you flash him to put him off? I love some of the premises in initial D. You, you think like, oh, I wonder how how many different like clever ways they can have for the protagonist to like win races. You know, oh, you'll like use as a guard to do a drift, and that's like, okay, that's that's relatively interesting. One, but you, there's only so many you can do. Oh, you ended up having a better engine after all, or something. Um, but the my favourite is a really fantastic one where it's kind of like it, it not he does something bad, but he wins by chance in a weird way where it's a nighttime race and then there's like no lights on the streets. It's a, like, a, over like a mountain. Um, and like, the opponent's obviously got his lights on, he's annoyed with it, but the main character, whatever his name is, he doesn't have his lights on, basically, to try and not warn the guy that he's behind him. So he wins because the guy in front, his lights pick up that cat's crossing the road or something. I think it's a cat. 
So obviously he slams on the brakes, but the like the main character doesn't see it because he's got his lights off, so he carries on. Obviously he doesn't hit him, but that's just by chance, and he actually beats him. It's so funny, like that's such a. I, I love that one because it's such an interesting premise. Like he's he's trying to like sneak up on him, but that's not really why he wins. Like because I don't know, it's because the guy actually has to brake. <laughs> Responsible driving lost the day, basically, which I thought was really cool. Okay, uh, one more, and then we'll go back to the main menu and see what we get. Hopefully, I can save. I don't know how much space I've got on this VM, which you never do. Right. Oh, cool, we get some even better music. I wonder what the options are on this. I kind of want to change the music balance to make it higher compared to the car sound. Uh oh. That I love. I, I never stop loving that idea of having randomly things in the middle of the road you have to avoid. Like, my favourite of that is. One of the, probably the greatest racing game of all time, and one of the greatest. Oh, it's me! One of the greatest DLCs ever. It's um, Project Gotham 2. The, the DLC for that is amazing, and I think I have it all. And now I don't think you're even allowed to buy it. So one of them was like Paris, and the other one was Long Beach, which were both just phenomenal. And the, yeah, I think it's Paris in particular. There's so many things. Were, oh, not again! Come on, come on, come on, come on. The Paris one has so many things in the middle of the road. It's amazing, yes. Yeah, it's, it's such a difficult battle. Man, I just want to play it now. It, either that is the best racing game of all time, or Drive Club is. I can kind of go back and forth between um, my life, but yeah, it's, it's absolutely phenomenal. No, come on, I've got to beat this guy. I've got to hit with no health left. It's just that one part of the course is so hard. Uh oh. Come on, I have to get ahead of him. Help. Come on, put him off. Come on, look at this! Come on, Elf! Elf it out! Elf oh! Oh my god, if I win now, come on. Oh, come on, son. That's Sylvia listening. She's still slaying in terms of Tokyo today. He needs to win. That's Sylvia listening. Or is it? Get out of the way, Matt. I'm trying to win a race. Oh, if he ever takes. It's over instantly. Oh, it's it. over instantly. Oh, well. Blame the trucks, not me. You still get some points. That's good. Is CP like credits, or is that another form of experience? Right, main menu. That's a shame, that would have been a really clutch victory if I just stayed at the end there. Win! New rivals! What does that mean? Okay, that is money. Rivals, right. Rolling guy! Oh, we didn't get that guy. Curving edge? I thought we did get that one. What? Oh, there. Oh, there's members of that team. Why, wow, his car is so dark you literally can't see it. That's not just the stream, I can't see it. Okay. Okay, so you don't really learn much about them. Oh, there's another one. They're both in curving edge. Okay. Yeah, it was the 25. I don't sell that. SS Limited. Elegant win. Max Racing. Wait, there's more than four. I thought this was going to be like the four Divas. Fire Drive. Twister. What the hell are going? Tokyo Jungle. How many others are there? Top level. Freeway. Another star speed. Bloody hell, John. Uh, is there are a lot of opponents in this game. Oh, and the four Divas, yeah. 137 enemy cars in the game. Jesus. I wonder what made them stop there. Like, they were like, we need more than 100. Right. Key config. No, I want that. Let's see what we can say. I might be able to change the sound balance. Okay. Battle. Uh, what's this one again? Garage, yeah. Oh, so you can you put your different cars in there, I guess. Okay, fine. And that's it, so that's battle. Let's try the other one. Assist off, and then we can drive into another nuclear blast. I hope there is another map. I've seen in the instructions for two that there's quite a lot of routes on that one. On this one, I'm not sure. I hope I really hope there is like at least a couple more circuit layouts, even if they're obviously going to use some of the same bits like they used to do in the Ridge Racer days. Ridge Wait, wait, okay. Shotoku Battle. Well, I don't know the corner name because they've reverted. Advertised. Oh wow, he's driving like I'm saying it's right. SS Limited, these guys would be way better. What does it say? Uh Oh Black Rain. Oh, that's the name of the person. Okay. That's what it is. Okay, so the name of the actual character is the thing in the middle of the time. SS Limited is the gang. Well, 
much what I've got to go. Whew, you can go either way, cool. I need more of that. Like, more open world highway racing. It's not open as in a wide world. You can only race on highways, but, <laughs> but that part is open. Alright, let's do it. Oh, let's try and flip the car over. The weight on it is pretty good. It's not. It's like, again, again, it's in between sim and arcade, but not in the best way. Like, it's in golf. It's, it's not too sad. Weights them there doesn't feel like a float vision. Which I guess Sega Rally 2 feels like that, it's a bit of a weird floaty. Sega GT has got a weird mix, like some depending on you can because one of the cool things of Sega GT I love oh, is that I want right few I thought I was going off the track. You could make your own car, like and it, it was actually like you could earn different body shells and they weren't just like a body shell of a car you know, there's loads of really interesting weird ones. It's amazing, that's such a cool thing that needs to come back. You could just like the drivetrain. You really could build a car with some scratch. And if you did that, and then you got it right, like the handling was good, but in quite a bit of the game, like the cars you get just the handling was weird and floaty. Like you know the engine could do good handling, but it was difficult to get it to work. Wait a minute, what the hell I've actually turned off to another whole weird bit? Cool. You actually do get some select soon. If that helps in a race like that, there's a way it would be better to go. Oh, is that very thin? But that's tough, especially if you're in against them. I hope they put in the odd, like, supercar at the beginning, that you know, like in an RPG when you see a mid boss. Right early on in the game, you're like, oh, I've got to get more powerful, so you've got to tune your car up. Uh, oh dear, this is not the way to go. This is a very difficult area. Both thin and the corner is ridiculous. I'm trying to avoid this section. Oh, oh I've got to do a drift tonight. Yeah, let's try and do that. Uh oh. Let's try and find another private right airlock. Oh, you can't see your lights when you're in first person. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I was trying to do a drift and fail myself. There we go. Oh, that's my It'd be funny if you could just challenge anybody in some random van that you just instantly defeat. Right, come on. Oh, that's my man. Hey, buddy. How's this? Another SS, okay. Nice to throw a crown one. It's not like a mega car. It looks like a sedan. It's actually an insane mega boss. Wow, this is so initial D as well. Music. Speed, speed, boy. Right, okay. Let's get this straight, so I'm gonna try and do a drift. Oh wow, the tower, Tokyo Tower. Alright, maybe at this big corner coming out. Maybe the car I had in the like little demo thing is just not the same grip level as this, so I can't drift it up. I've got him anyway. Boop boop. Nice. So I don't understand, there must be ways that you can like advance. I don't think you just hit free run and then you keep going, eventually you run into a deep run. I'm sure there's like levels, or there'll be something to delineate it, right? It must be. I'm not gonna have 187 enemies just wandering around here. If you find every car from one team, like you have to use challenge or something. There's gotta be more to it than this. Oh, that means it's gone weird. Oh, that's jump. That was just oh another star. Uh it's called Kami. Kami so Kami Star, I don't know. Well, let's get him. Jesus Christ. I'm in 
up against another star. I got my upgraded bumper, come on! Oh, we're not getting close. Okay, so maybe, like I was saying, there is like higher level enemies out there at the beginning. So I might be to put stuff wrong now, but at the time I was doing fine. He's still out pacing me. Okay, right. Got some main menu, see if we can see if anything's happened. Hey, is that Gribble Grebble? Alright, dude, we're just playing a bit of Tokyo Highway Battle. Right, tune in. We're, we're driving the Sylvia at the moment. Yeah, so we've got uh, our wheels. Yeah, let's get some cool wheels. Nice. Quite small though, would be nice if the wheels were a bit bigger. That's cool. How much is this? Why can't I use them? Why is that great? Oh, do you have to buy them? Is that. Oh, buy parts. Yeah, door. Okay. Wait, why is mine look really expensive with that? I should have my four grand on that. Oh well, go anyway. Uh, muffler, let's see if we can get a better engine sound. Twin. Oh, mega size one. That's the one that's probably going to sound ridiculous. Let's do it. Hopefully, it does change the sound. Right, let's go out there. What can you do for settings? Oh, so, oh, steering quickness probably. It's good if you got a uh, steering wheel. Oh, braking. Uh, braking response. Uh, braking. Balance, rear and front. Oh, low. Can we do like a lower car? Do you have to actually have a, a gear kit for that? Hey, how does that work out? Let's try it. Default. Oh, wait, I can't move it though. Okay, remember we have to get the parts for that. So, what's that? Uh, banner. Don't know what that one is. Uh, Cross transmission, I think. Max speed. Okay, well, we'll leave those two for now. Let's get out of there. Uh, what else have you got? So, battle system. What's this? Just save it. I don't know how we're going to find more dudes. You'll. Uh oh. When you say you'll lose, don't tell me I'm on. Um, I'm not deaf. I'm not. I'm not deaf. I'm not mute. Am I? Okay, cool. You just me. I lost. Okay, thank God. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, I don't mind losing, but I don't want to. Right. Uh, rivals. Yeah, so what, what else? How do we. Oh, three days. So it's day based. Maybe after a certain number of days something happens. Like, I don't. I can't imagine it's just hit battle every time. Right, let's do it. Yeah, it seems like a good game, this. But if it is just. There's 137 enemies in the game to like challenge. But if it's just. You have to free run every time and nothing new happens, it might not be the best. I've got like that's this one, and I have got the sequel because they're really cheap sealed as well. So I thought again, okay, apparently the second one is really good. That's the one to, that's like where it got great. But because of this runs on the VGA box, like this is the greatest output the the um, Gen Cars can do, like 60 frames a second and 4 uh, 480p. I think it's something like 500 and a bit p, but I've just downsampled it because it's a bit of a weird. One. Oh, there's a guy there. Hang on. Do your lights, boop boop. Uh, obviously you got your uh, interior. Come on, mate. All right. Oh, that's the hardest turn in the game I've found so far, so get past that first. That's good. Can't see the sound of the engines much different to what it was. Right, let's do it. Oh, it's this guy, this is the crown. Oh, bubble. Right, let's go. Let's beat him. Oh no, what's this car, Jim? I've seen this before with those like lights like that. Is that a toy? Oh, they, you know, they've got like the silver surround on the lights. I'm going to recognise so you won't see it. Not an Altezza or something? Oh. Right, let's do this. It's got the NSX in this, it's got loads of good cars, but it, has, oh, it hasn't got the. Uh, sorry. Uh, it's got a Supra. Right. I have to look at number two as well and see if they've got some of the other cars. Right, let's rock. It's even got Mercedes as well. It's quite surprising. I guess there's cars that they have seen on the Toko Highway scene. Uh oh. 
trucky. Oh, there we go, a bit of a drift, not too bad. Hard to get in the tyres. Drifting. Oh, just at higher speeds. Uh oh, uh oh, oh yeah, flip it up. Just about a win, come on. Up up. Got him. Not as in-depth as Garfield car. Oh, we were just watching a thing about Garfield the other day. Fantastic. Oh, Lexus i200, yeah, we got our Intel guy here on the scene, so it's good. Yeah, replays are actually good in this. I really show off Dreamcast power at times. Right, let's get another one under our belt. I hope there is some kind of like not seasonal progression or some kind of thing where it has it, it's not literally the same the entire game like there is actually a, I don't know a delineation between your first few enemies you fight and then when you get towards the last ones what's this 180 SX maybe I actually don't know not MR2 is it trying to get close to it You gotta play this in manual, there's so few bits to do. But obviously I'm surprised you gotta accelerate and turn like every other racing game, there's not an awful lot of cost chance. You do wanna have a bit of uh, manual. Yeah, what's this car? Oh he's gone. My rear view. Uh no mate! Hello! What a punk, he must have been hired by the other guy to stop me. No, nope. how dare you? I'm just going in the car to get a rear view mirror. No, mate, how about no? Damn the damage. What's he called? Uh. Roshi. Fuck. Oh, something wolf, yeah. Oh, lone, wo lone wolf, this guy's called. Even though he's in a team, that makes good sense. He's right. He's actually doing better than the other one. How did I? You got your Tokyo Tower there. Where's Tokyo Joe? Oh, this is a nice easy bit of the track, you should be able to kick ass if he said not jinxing anything. Yeah, I don't think the buffalo changed the sound, I certainly hope it does. Whoa, whoa. One thing would be cool as well, it'd be funny if you could, you get, you drive past another rival whilst you're in a battle and he just joins in, that'd be great. That's, uh, well, I don't know if that's in the second one, but that's a bit more of an advanced thing. Uh oh, no mate, I'm just about to beat him, don't taxi it up, this isn't crazy taxi, this is very bland normal taxi this game. Got him! Yeah, you get really get more points the longer it goes on. Right, okay. Oh, Bossonanic! Where's my TV from Bossonanic? Right, let's do one more now, I'll go back to the menu and see what we got. Uh oh, oh well, am I going the wrong thing again? This is the bad way, I think. Oh, green must be ones you've beaten. Oh, okay, so there you go. So we, we've got... Am I yellow? Yeah, so we've got to beat the, all the blue ones, I guess, and then the pink one maybe is a tough one? Okay, so there is a progression to it. That's obviously not all 187 cars, surprise. Let's try and take down all these ones, and then we'll see. Uh, I wonder if you're allowed to just turn around, like, go the wrong way, because... Bloody hell, is that hard at all? Because obviously if you go past someone, you're supposed to take down. It'll take centuries to go all the way back around again. Yeah, this, don't go this way. This part of the track is so hard, it's so thin. It's insane points. Just do not do it. If you can, uh, be good if you set up your like track list as well, because some of the music this is good. Either it's a harder enemy, or maybe that's one you've challenged and lost to. I wonder if it's too green in the ones I've been. This is a game that definitely benefits from like, having weather as well. So obviously, you can't have a day night cycle because the whole point of the game is nighttime races in Tokyo. Um, and then the tracks are just obviously the highways, so you can't do an awful lot with that. You can add a few more in, I guess. But yeah, having rain and stuff would be great. 
storms. Uh oh. an NSX. What? Oh dear. Oh, good old Attic and Wild, so I'm utterly gonna die here. What's he called? Host... Hostman... Hostman Hat? Hat? What? Oh, Postman Pat, but... It, I think it's meant to be Postman Pat, but they haven't put in the accents. So it's just Hostman Hat. It's probably like a take on it. It's still a weird thing to know if you're a Japanese level, though, Postman Pat. There is a European version of this, but I don't know if it had 60 frames, so I just got this one, it's cheap anyway. Right, let's do it. Take down the NSX somehow. Doesn't seem very believable, but. How fast the. Okay, maybe it's just a terrible race. He's too busy delivering the mail. It has a network mode, but I think it's just like uploading times. Though. I think. Okay, so where's the other one? Oh, come up on him! Come on. Getting the other one's gonna be a pain. Last week. That's the X-Men Academy. It's apparently in Tokyo. Oh, oh dear. Thanks for calling it a tailback. You are an utter punk. Where's that taxi that's called? He's crazy. Imagine all them taxi drivers wearing their gloves there. So, uh, cool little hitmen in Japan. Oh, this music's weird. It's funny, because obviously if you're in a really hard opponent, the tactics are interesting, because you could just wait around and wait for him to drive to the easiest part of the track and take him on. Oh, that's, that's weird. That's not going to come up in any other game, really. You kind of set the stage. Oh, is it Johnny Mercedes? Time some initial leave music. Come on, get out of the way, I want to beat you. Get out of the way! I said that when I have to try and dissolve this car with my laser. Oh, God, I must go right here. There's a choice I'm going to make. Get out of the way! Oh, go okay, right, go right, go right. Oh, my God, for that one. I don't remember this side of it. It can't be harder than the other side. No, it looks cool. Oh, is it R34? It reminds me of that section in Grand Turismo, this bit. Is it R34 Raceway or something like that? Yeah. Got him! Yo! <laughs> you, yo, you bitch! Alright, Church of Aiden. Got him. Right, so we got oh, one guy to do. Can I go the wrong way around the track? Let's find out. This is going to be a long day otherwise. I might just go main menu and try and reset maybe. But I don't want to reset all the other ones as well. Oh, hey! What the hell? Oh, it's just one of the... Oh, does it, did it just do the auto part? Hang on, is that because it was an enemy car? Alright. Uh, hello mate! I'm trying to go the wrong way down the highway here. Can you leave me alone? Right, is it going to auto pilot me the right way? Damn it! Okay. Wow, that's terrible. I'm just going to have to go main menu. I'm not going to go around the entire route just to see that guy. Alright. Right. Okay, so we've got those four. So that's just like four days. Uh, right, so if I could be... Where's the... Is this where you can buy a new car? No, it's a shot. I want to show Jimbo the, um, all the different cars they have in the game, basically. So, right, so obviously you can have the trainer and surprise. And you got MR2. Uh, there's Supra, excellent. That's 
the oh, I must be that i200 you're talking about the Lexus whatever uh, don't know guess it's another Lexus probably. the Sylvia <laughs> excuse me and another Sylvia that's the other one like the S14 you got your uh, MR2 yeah here we go you got the R32 I-33, fantastic, these are the ones obviously we're going to try and get. Got your Fair Lady Z. That's, I guess, the Mercedes, I think. Or maybe that is a Crown. That's a Toyota Crown, right? That's, oh, that's another Lexus. Got your Civic. That's the Evil DC2. Boo! Got your NSX. Fantastic. Obviously, the price is insane. That's the, probably the best car. Got your Prezzo. Another one. Ah, oh, you got your RX-7. Got your Super RX-7. And then, obviously, that... Uh, Bunters in Pretzel basically and then you're back to that so yeah they've got a good selection obviously it's clear they're going for initial D here right uh, let's just battle until we take out an entire map's worth hopefully they haven't reset them all they probably have yeah where's the sorry exactly that's what I'm looking for um, hopefully in the sequel oh, and also you probably won't see us too well but in the corner you've got your little Genki face which is awesome as well I love that Genki is such a great developer picture right uh, oh, it has reset most of them. Damn it. I only want to challenge that pink dude now. you got to do that before you finish the stream. Right, I think I'll take on one of these blue guys and then we'll just try and chase down the pink. We've already beaten this one, so I'm not going to redo it. Okay. Yeah, it's such a shame you can't go backwards. I mean, you can just stand still, I guess. That's hardly the spirit of the game, isn't it? They should like provide turning points. Like obviously, you would want me to be going the wrong way down the highway. They probably that's why they're not encouraging it. But you could actually get obviously get to the other side, like real life. Uh, I guess they just thought, ah, oh, forget it. You just have to drive around. It's too bad, buddy. I like a beast. Oh yeah. I think it's we can't do the options from within this mode because I do. I do really want to switch up the balance between the music and the sound effects because the music's too quiet. Right, let's take this guy down. Oh, oh okay, so the muffler, maybe that is making the muffler making a slightly different sound. Oh, super art, that's been mega fast. Come on, mate. Try and ram off the road first. Elegant Wild. Oh, these are the good team, aren't they? So, what's he called? Right, so. White. Ro white Revolution, I think. Got a white car surprise. Right, let's do it. Yeah, this team is hard. Elegant Wild, I think. Oh, oh, what? Oh, it's that corner. Actually, that helped. <laughs> I was about to do that wrong, so thanks for breaking into me. Now i got to try and stay ahead. I better use a review camera because he's obviously going to be faster than mine. Oh, big corner, come on. Cool. Alright, maybe this isn't going to be quite so bad. Can't let him get in front though, probably just power away. Uh, oh, dear. Oh, what? Oh, almost. I was like I was going to fleet my way through there. Not quite. It was a bit difficult with three enemy cars, though. Come on. Come on. Yes. I've got another car. How bad is it? Nice trucky. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, he had a trucky otomy. Damn you. Crunch him. Oh, I'm going to get back to that. It's a bad one. Uh, my health is getting vaporized, yeah. I think it might be done. Yeah, that's not too good. Oh, yeah. Come on! I've... Oh, if I didn't hit that other wall, I might actually just survive there, but. Yeah, I think it might be done unless he crashes here. Poo! Alright, good race though. We got down to like a third or just like that. 
fine. Right, hopefully we're near the our actual target. Where am I? Oh yeah, uh That's two here. Oh just pink just means something you've fought and lost to. So it's not like an interesting character or anything. That's no good, is it? So wait, that's that guy. Is there another one here as well? Just behind us, I think. Come on, bring it. Yeah, I do wonder what happens if you actually like beat all of the ones on one map so they all go green. Because obviously, it can't just have you just driving around doing nothing after that. There'd have to be something. So maybe that you do get a cutscene or something if you do that. Oi. Like that. But I, yeah, I don't wonder what triggers it. I guess you're just literally beating as, as many people as you can and that, that was what makes them appear, I don't know. Because presumably you could just use any car, like you're expected to get enough money to buy one of the more powerful cars, but how far can you tune up the base ones, I wonder. Come here, man. Beat this bird. Oi! Boy, uh oh, easy game with that. Good, I need to see that. Jeez, that's close. I'll do a blockage. Carry me. Cool. I pass the X Men Academy. Oh, there's, there's probably certain opponents that only appear on certain directions as well. Probably I assume it has to be that way. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, that's not the best. Where is he? Nope. Oh, that's going great. Spot Pro Gaming. Come on, we need to actually boost the way here. No more traffic. Just for a little bit. Oh. Come on. Alright, that actually went okay. Pretty much most of the roadblock there, so can't feel too bad about that. Let's go. It's Boss or Nanny. Yeah, boy. Okay, cool. So 200. So, so you can sort of tell how difficult the enemy is by the rival's prize percentage, I guess. Right, let's just do one more and then I think we're done. Oh, we've learned about the um, the uh, purple square doesn't actually mean anything. So it's kind of lost a bit of interest in this. Oh, I'm straight into Ah, oh, here we go! Ah, oh, I'm straight into another race. I haven't decided this one. Oh, I've been attacked by an opponent. Okay, that's great. This is the kind of thing I was hoping for. You do actually get events. Like, you, you don't just do the same thing from the beginning of the game right to the very end. Right, so someone's challenged me now because I've beaten enough people. Maybe the, enough people from his crew I've beaten. So he's like, this is like the leader of that one. So let's find out. Thank you, that's exactly what I was looking for. It's funny because obviously something like this where it's like obviously illegal street racing. In a game that was made in the West probably almost certainly would have like a cop salad that you have to like deal with. I, th I was, you know, I'm not trying to generalize too much, but I'm assuming because it's done in Japan that the idea is, is like trying to disobey the cops too much or like have them as the enemy. So it's just not a function of it. At least that's how I, I gather it's probably why it's like that. Oh, come on. Like you said, that depends how it's done. Like in what's one of the new speed games, it's just so they're so utterly aggressive, it's ridiculous, it just breaks the game. It's just being attacked by like six cars, just hammered until you destroy it, it's insane. And then, you know, as you saw in Need for Speed, the original one is like comically easy against the police. Oh, uh, damn, I thought I had more health than that. Come on. I was actually going to win this one. I didn't realise it was quite as bad a situation as it was. Damn, son. How dare you! Alright, let's go. Let's see if we can buy any more gear and then that's going to be it. But at least you get a taste of what it's like. Actually, let's have a quick look and see what that... If we can find out who that car was as well. Was it SS Limited? See if we've got them all. Number one, it must be that guy, right? Yeah. So, what have you beat that one? What's another one? So these are all like the monster cars. 
Yes, yeah, so that's all of them. So we've beaten everybody except for one in that. So, all right, so that makes sense. So they do challenge you once you do that. Uh, right, let's have a look see if we can get any like turbos or anything. So that's engine. So what, what can you have? Our oh, stage one upgrade to three thousand twelve eighteen. So I can about once you don't see anything. Let's get one. So it doesn't show what the top speed is. Is this the drivetrain or? Uh. Chassis, so you can go like stabilize chassis or whatever. Uh, muffler, we've done, wheel, we've done, aero, we've done, and color. Okay, so let's get what I assume is drivetrain. Get acceleration, I guess. Alright, cool. Let's save it up. Alright, so have a quick race out there just to see if the, um, if the, uh, does anything, like how, how much you get off doing. Oh! Oh, other car mark on. Oh, I just pressed trigger there. I don't know if you're meant to do that. What does that mean? Other car marks on on the um map, on the map already. So what does that what does that even mean? I don't know. Let's see if we get an actual speed boost out of this. Okay, obviously it doesn't feel noticeably, we've only got stage one. Oh! Oh, other car marks as in even other random cars, you get little arrows. So yeah, I'm just trying to see what speed I can get to. Okay, so I mean, yeah, I don't need that. I think that's a bit of a immersion breaking thing to have it on there. Unless it means you can like challenge anybody, but it doesn't. Yeah, that's why I'm not going to have that on. Obviously that's, that's probably going to be strictly the way to play the game makes it easiest but I'm going to do that. Oh. Right, I think that'll do. It doesn't really seem nice to be faster at all, but I mean it's stage one upgrade so it's not exactly a huge surprise. What's the uh, top speed are we gonna see? No, it looks like we're not gonna Okay. Well there you go, so that's your took your extreme rare sir John. It's good stuff. It's like insanely cheap on drink in Japan. Right. That's been brilliant, and uh, all that's left to say then, I guess, is uh, thank you very much for watching, and we'll catch you next time on Channel Alicon. Bye.